Impress yourself. Man, that was my, my lips were really chapped. It's your boy, Young Man, be back with another video. And today we've got an immaculate team made by none other than Tio himself. Um, so Tio, if you guys don't know, he's a really, 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 really good Pokemon player. Um, but yeah, he's also a good team builder. He's, yeah, he makes creative teams. And this one is very, very creative, just my style. So uh, I guess what I can say is this Thunderous has Swagger for Lando, which has a Lum, and it's got um, Tapu Fini, which has um, a Life Orb. So yeah. So it's also a physical Tapu Fini because of the Swagger. So pretty cool stuff, but let's get into some games um, right away to see if we can show off the team. Um, let's do it. Team Yell against 422. Good. Gotta start with 422 from the Japan region. Um, wow, Mimic U is kind of weird there. But other than that, it's a rain, a range and a rain station. So what I think Thunderous is absolutely a monster here. Um, I like everything other than Zation coming in and destroying me. Yeah, Zation seems like a fat problem. How, how does one deal with Zation with this team? I have my Zation, of course. I do have Scary Face, I guess. Which could be really nice. Hmm. I just gotta think. How fast is our Zation? I think, that, I think it's supposed to be max speed. I'm not sure, because the Rusted Sword's weird. Um. Okay, let's go with Zation. And we'll go with Lando. And I think we'll go with Feeny. No, wait, we don't want Lando, do we? I think we'll go with Feeny. And we'll go Lando and then Zation in the back. So we have tools if Zation is led against us. But we've always got things like the magical eerie impulse if we need them. And they have zero intimidator, so it's going to be really nice to have a top of Feeny here. Um, yeah, and if they have Prankster Thunders, which it probably is. Um, it's just not going to do much to my Feeny because I got the train, I've got the. Uh, I'm a physical attacker, so they can't eerie impulse me. Um, but yeah. So Feeny might be our clutch our clutch win condition here, but we'll see, we'll see. Honestly, if I can get a swagger without Zation being in, then, then we're in we're an amazing spot. Okay, so we got Thunderous. Okay, this is fine. This is fizzity fine. Um, the problem is they're both potentially physical attackers, which could be really, really bad. Um yeah. So it makes me apprehensive because it might be coaching Cinderace is the problem. And if it's coaching Cinderace, well then Tapu Fini is not great here. Um, <clears throat> yeah. So that could be a problem. Of course, Lando isn't going to help me a whole lot. However, I could do this. I could swagger myself and Ice Punch. So I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. I don't know if we'll live that long, but as long as um, plus one, I don't think I don't think plus one will be able to kill Feeny because Feeny is very very yoked. Okay, so they do max. It might be that Thunderous, but we'll see. It could be it could be Cinderace. If it's Cinderace, I think we have way more of a problem. But we need to kill the Thundee. Okay, so it is the Thundee. Okay, so I don't know if a plus two max hailstorm actually kills it. My guess would be no, but maybe it does. But we'll see. We have to live ourselves first. I, I think this is going to be something stupid like coaching Cinderace. Um, well, let's see. Let us see. Okay, so we Dynamaxing Physical Feeny turn one. This is how we do. Um, okay. I don't think plus one max lightning will kill me. Considering, yeah, this, considering, I don't know, I've been Dynamaxing Thunderous a lot this, this series. It's very weak. It's very good, of course, but it's very weak. Okay, we swagger ourselves. We do connect, which is great. We are wide lens to make sure we hit more often. Um, we are now plus two. They do go for coaching. Okay, everything I've predicted has gone right so far. That does give them physical defense, though, so that's going to make it even harder for me to kill. So keep that in mind, myself. There's a max airstream. That's not doing much at all, so that's great. Um, if I scary face, I don't think I would be faster. But I can check my speed and make sure. We'll see. Let's see how much this does. Oh yeah, that's damage right there. Whew. 
All right, that's awesome. That is great damage. Man, that would have definitely killed if it didn't get uh, the coaching boost. That's a fantastic, that's fantastic damage. Okay. Uh, citrus? No, we don't have citrus. Okay, um, this could be a problem. I don't have any speed control if I let this thunderous go down, so I need to be very, very careful. However, I can scary face the Cinderace, and it won't get the coaching boost. I think I'm going to go for that. It won't get the coaching boost first, and I think I'm also going to max Geyser over. Ooh. I actually, yeah, I think I actually want to max Starfall over here. I don't want to set the rain because I want the hail to kill this thunderous eventually. Let's see if this makes any sense. Okay, we get the scary face off. I don't know if we're faster. I would honestly bet that we aren't, but as long as coaching goes second, it doesn't really matter. Uh, Max Lightning does come out this time. And we do live as I predicted, which is great. Now, can we live through this turn? Pyro Ball. Now, that's probably into my left side, and of course it's still faster than my Feeny. Minus one is faster than my neutral. Okay. We do lose... Okay. We lose one, but it's okay. Now the problem is... Zation comes in and becomes very problematic for us. But we'll see. We will see if we can win this one. Yeah, because the hail's going to take another turn, so it's gonna, they're going to get their Dynamax turn off. In fact, I might die to the hail. Oh my god, they could, they could potentially live hail. I don't have any priority, is the problem. See, I think I go into this anyway. Yeah, I think we're going to go into this. They don't have Intimidate, so I have to go into this and protect, and they'll let Feeny die. Now, there's Asian. Now, if they sub or Swords Dance or anything, then that's bad. But we can see who's faster here. It looks like they're faster or it's a speed tie. Um, and Scary Face, so close to helping me. If I had just gotten my attack off before, we're at 200 speed, so they're probably just faster. So it doesn't matter if they go for an airstream here then, uh, but I'm going to protect and now we'll guy. I don't think we'll get the guys that are off, of course, but I'm going to click it anyway. Okay, we protect, which means they attacked. Um, they do go for max knuckles, so that's obviously really bad because they boost up their. So like my intimidate is literally pointless, but it's fine. Um, yeah. Let's see what Zayjin goes through here. It might just attack. Thinking, hey, if I attack, I'm stronger. And I kill. But let's see. I'm hoping that thing dies to hail. If not, we're going to be in trouble. Ah, uh, okay, well, this game's over. They're faster. They're stronger. They could click the right buttons. Yeah, I got really unlucky here that that, at least it does die, but th yeah, that it got all of its turns out. Uh, like, scary face and not being so useless there was annoying. Like, uh, <clears throat> alright. Polytoad comes in. Lando comes in. The thing is, if this thing attacks, we die, and they're probably just gonna go for the safe attack over on to the right side. Which it doesn't really matter. I don't think it really matters. Yeah, I, I don't think it matters at all what I do here because the Zation just kills whatever it wants. So I think what I have to do is go for a double protect. Um, yeah, I think we have to go for the double protect because I think the Zation will go for the Zation. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to Earthquake here. And then we double the Zation next turn with the same play, but we'll see. I think this is the only way. This is, yeah. Yeah, this is bad no matter what, especially because Politoed beats me. I do get the double protect though, so that's actually pretty good. I think Zation's gonna go for my Zation. Yep. Uh, I need, I need, what's it called to live though? 
I need Lando to live a water move, which I don't know if it will in the rain. But if it does, that would be nice. Okay. It was for icy wind. Okay. It is quite effective, but... Can I live two of these? Yeah, but I'd be slower than that. Makes this really tough. I don't think a triple protect is worth it, but I can go for it. I think I will go for it, honestly. I think that's my win condition, so I'm going to go for it. I've never gotten a triple protect, so that would be nice. I didn't get it, but that's okay. I, I think I had to go for that. Because if I got that there, then I could beat the Politoed, but if I can't beat the Politoed this way. Bye, my sweet prince. Yeah, I think I had to go for that there. Now I have to hope they miss Icy Wind, maybe? If they miss Icy Wind, I think I can win. Yeah. Hopefully they went for Icy Wind and missed. Come on. Uh, make things harder. Of course I still have Rock Slide. Yeah. Icy Wind. Muddy Water. Oh, even less accurate. Dang it, I had a better chance to win there. 85% of the time. I could have, or fifteen percent of the time, I guess I could have died. Ugh, not bad, not bad. It's kind of a really hard matchup for my team. Like, I have physical. My my ways of attacking are physical Feeny and physical Lando, both of which um, Thundee can kind of deal with. Although Lando, in hindsight, would have been a whole lot better because it would have been plus one. Well, it would have, it would have, it would have been plus two, but I would have one shot it with Lando rather than Feeny. Maybe not. I don't know because the coaching was really annoying. I, either way, that was. A really bad matchup, and it's, the thing is, who's using coaching injuries? Apparently, ranked 300 in Japan, but who's winning with it? Um, yeah, whatever. Get you get gets a lucky matchup, but it's fine. Ice. I'm ice, ice baby. Oh my god. Okay. Wow. This is looking like a team I would make. Oranguru <laughs> and. Oranguru and Dragology is something I made forever ago. Um, how do we want to do this? I actually really like Feeny here. We don't get like Thunder Wave or anything, which is cool. Um, however, I think you always want this guy. They don't have a terrain user, do they? They don't. It's kind of nice. I guess they can always max guard Trick Room. Hmm. We're likely going to have to Dynamax the Feeny, I feel. Let's see what we can do with this. Maybe we'll, we'll trick him a little bit here. Go with this in the back. And then this. Yeah, this, this should be fine. Okay, let's just try this. Because if they lead Live Hard, they're going to want to click Fake Out. But I have Indeedee in the back, so maybe I can get away with it. We'll see, though. We shall see. Alright. Blink and blink. Alright, well, they led with it. Now, where Sashers do, I don't know if we even kill. But they're gonna wanna go for a fake out, aren't they? Honestly? Urshifu is the swap here. But they might max guard Trick Room. But that's okay, I think. Yeah, either way, it's okay. So I'm gonna go into in DD, which has the safety goggles, which I enjoy. And now we behemoth blade. I think this works because I think they want to fake out. Either way, though, it's kind of troublesome. I think they have to max guard trick room, honestly. But we'll see. If I if I got him, I got him. Dynamax. They did Dynamax, okay, so they probably want Max Guard Trick Room. Okay, this is not bad. We're wasting... See, I follow me Trick Room this next turn, and they lose their Dynamax. So that's really good. Right? We'll see. As long as they don't... They might... So they, uh, they Max Guard right here. Yeah, so they can't Max Guard next turn, so even if they switch in Torkoal, I still kill their thing. I'm low battery! Copycat Trick Room, okay. It's fine. I knew I should have charged it over the weekend. Um, okay. Yeah, I just follow me, Trick Room. Okay, here we go. Follow me. 
Now, if they have max steel spike, that's obviously annoying. But we're still about to smack the crap out of their, their Dynamax. Yeah, so they're going into Torgal here. But they can't max guard again, is the thing. Yeah. I'm a Torgal player. I bring in Torgal. Ooh, I'm good. Okay. Follow me. Again, they can't max guard. Again, max steel spike would be absolutely the most annoying here. They have Quake, though, so that's fine. That's an, actually amazing for me. So, let's see how much this does. Doesn't even do more than half. Okay. Let's see what item it was. And now we do double damage. Good. Bye. You had a Dynamax. And now you don't. And that's the rules. Alright. So that was awesome. I had to waste a whole lot of effort just to get Trick Room up. I had to waste a Dynamax essentially to get Trick Room up with what they had there. Or against basically what I had on my team. You think I could charge my thing while I play? Hopefully it doesn't run out of charge. Okay, so they bring in another useless Pokemon, so that's awesome. I'm going to click Expanding Force here and Protect. Because basically it's just going to die. Sableye is literally useless here. So that's cool. Save life hard swaps. Couldn't tell you why. Um, and they go into live hearts. They have two prankster Pokemon that are just completely useless. Dang it. And I kind of wanted to save my Feeny, but it's fine. Corruption. Yep. Yeah. Okay, goodbye. I'll miss you. I'll miss you, Feeny. Okay, Feeny's gone. Station only has 168 health. I think Tio may have messed up. Unless it just doesn't have any... HP investment, but this thing gets all the way to 200, right? Um, now, is there a point to save Zacian here? I would say yes. Okay, but we have Physical Feeny, which is great. Oh, I changed the terrain. Now the Prankster Mons can do their thing. That sucks. Um, anyway, we max Waterfall. Set up the rain, and we're going to sack Urshifu here. Oh, we're going to have second Sash. Okay, but now Liveheart can do stuff, which is annoying. But what can you do about it? Liveheart and... Stupid... Quash Sableye. But it's fine, because uh, Feeny beats all three of these Pokemon, so if I Dynamax it, we're golden. Especially if I change the weather here. Okay. Make it rain. Make it rain, Feeny. Okay. They go for Fake Out. I wonder if they know that doesn't work on Dynamax Pokemon. They probably didn't expect me to Dynamax, of course. Okay, we do go to our Sash, but um, we live that quite nicely. Okay, Max Geyser. Sploosh. Okay. Now we need to get a kill. How many turns of Trick Room is the thing? One. Nice. Um, let's go for... Honestly, this is a Max Geyser in the rain. It's going to hit Sableye pretty hard. I'm going to protect over here. I mean, if they switch Sableye, they still take a lot of damage. See? Oh, they switched that one. Huh. Even if Torgo protects, it might die. Okay. It's really not a big deal, honestly. Okay, it goes for eruption, tr tries to kill that. Okay. <laughs> not quite as much damage as I was doing before. That means it's probably something stupid like Specs. Uh, Max Goiza. And we do kill through Protect, so that should be game, because all they have is two Prankster Pokemon. Like, what are they gonna do? And they can't even, like, burn me or anything. Now the question is, do I go for Sableye or do I go for the other one? Alright, I'm going to go for Max Starfall. I'm going to go into this one. And then we're going to hard switch in Zation. Because they have a fake out here. So it is the optimal play. Plus neither of these Pokemon can really do much. Okay. And 
go for fake out. As expected. Okay, and max starfall. That means they have an attacking move, which is interesting. I wonder if this lives. The answer is yes, because it has sash. Good for you. Okay. And metal burst. What? What happened to my Pokemon? What was that? <laughs> no, not like this. Okay. Well, that was really sad. <laughs> I got destroyed! Now, if this thing has Shadow Sneak, the game is slightly more annoying. However, I think we Wicked Blow. And we Behemoth Blade. I, I, honestly, I would click Sacred Sword, but Behemoth Blade probably is a KO, so there's no point to click that. Ah. <sighs> They actually have faint. Okay. Oh my god. <sighs> I don't think I lose, but this is still stupid. Alright. Let's see what how much this does. This is minus one. Yeah, well. Still alive, but barely breathing. So now we go for the save light, I guess. Metal Burst Faint. Very strange. And it's Sash, of course. Even with all these best of one techs, you're still getting you're still losing. This this, this is the really sad part for you, my dude. Or dudette. Or theyet. Alright. Just take your time. You might as well try to timer stall. It's not gonna work, but you might as well. Good job, good job. No, you're doing great. No, you're doing really great. I think you're doing great. Okay. Now they lose this one. Bye. Goodbye. Now I can go for Sacred Sword. Brain stops, not that it matters. Mist disappeared. Do you want a timer stall now? Because now I'm winning because I have more health than you. But I'll click Sacred Sword. Oh, they cancelled? What? You mean all that play was completely pointless? Alright. Because Sableye and Liepard would never beat Zation in 15 years. Alright. On to the next. So there we got her. Got a nice W. Boom! Give me all my rank back. Didn't deserve to lose it in the first place. Alright. He turned it as three. I picked a bad one, I'm sorry. Alright, 3,400. Okay. So this Thunderous doesn't have. <laughs> Hold on. Do I have like Taunt or something? Uh. I have eerie impulse at least. Honestly, yeah, I don't give a I don't give a rip. I don't give a, a rip if this thing. It, okay, we we do the same thing. We got this. We got this. This guy doesn't have coaching. The last guy had coaching, which made thunderous stupidly hard to deal with for no reason at all. This time we got this. We got this. Now the question is: Does minus one life orb Feeny one shot Lando? That is what I would like to know. If it does, that's amazing. I would think it would, because we're life orb, so that's basically like being almost back to neutral. Plus it's four times super effective. I would say it has to, right? Two, no, yeah, that's strong. Alright, let's see. Let's see what they got. Porygon 2. Thunderous. Alright, well, this is where we kill... Where we kill... Our friend on the left side there. I don't... I, I literally don't give a crap if they, uh... Trick Room or not. Because I'm already slow, and I've got Prankster. Special. Attack, 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 attack. Thank you. Okay. We hit him with the swag. I got that swagger. Um... I'm gonna hit Hailstorm just in case they do Dynamax. Come on, physical Feeny! You got this. 
You know it's always a physical feeny if they're shiny. If they're non-shiny, it's probably a regular. I'm just kidding, I don't know. I'm just I'm just speaking. And let's see what they do here. But this is this is great for us. This is great. They don't dynamax, okay, so that's good. I hope they eerie impulse, that would be funny. They can't thunder wave. They could scary face, but that doesn't do anything. I'm not sure what Thunderous is even attempting to do here. Now if it clicks fly, then that's something. Not something good, but something. Okay. Let's see what they do. Swag. So my I don't know, I don't I, I really don't know what's going on here. Thunder Bolt. Thunderbolt. The bolt of thunders. Okay. Well, I'll take a kill for 40% on my Prankster Pokemon. Now let's see what this Porygon 2 does. Could try attack kill me? I would think not. But we'll see. It might. It would be bad if it does. It's not the end of the world, honestly, but... Where, where, where got this momentum? So they go... Uh, Ice Beam will kill me, though. That's unfortunate. Uh, maybe a lie. I think we'll live. We are alive! That's amazing. I can either go for another Swagger, I can go for a Scary Face. A lot of things I can do. This might be Zacian? Yep, okay. I can go for a Scary Face here. If I do end up dying, it's not the end of the world. Okay. Yeah, this is not the end of the world, especially if I get the Scary Face off. They might just protect, but... What can you do? We'll actually save my guy if they don't attack it with a Max Geyser. Uh, they're Dynamaxing the Duck. Interesting. It's not like it's powerful or anything, so that's good. I'll take that, honestly. I don't have a whole lot other than a Zacian that can just shred it to pieces. Um, so if I actually kill this... Um, if I kill this uh, Zacian, we're, we're kind of home free. But they might protect here. I expect them to, honestly. Yep, 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 yep. That's fine. It's fine. That's fine. Okay. Scary face. Max Geyser. Now, if they go for Feeny here, then we're still fine. Oh, look at that damage. That's through Protect. That was 25%, so we would have murdered that thing. Actually, it was a crit. Okay, fine. Now, they have to go for... They have to go for Lando here. Hey, they go for a max strike. Is it into Lando, though? Nope, it's not. So we have another prankster turn. We are still alive. Still alive and I'm barely breathing. Problem is, I've taken a lot of damage now. But I still want a scary face. I would like to honestly eerie impulse too. But, scary face is good. Because if I scary face, then my Zacian comes in and goes to town. Could even max guard potentially here. It's not a bad play, honestly. Max guard, think about it. Station comes in, and then we're, yeah. Yeah, I think that's good. Let's max guard, let's max guard. Let's do it. Unless they max strike the left side, that would be painful, but we'll see. Okay, scary face. Wow, 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 wow. They go for Behemoth Blade. Bing! Sorry. They might max track my left side. They Hailstorm. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Because now my Zacian comes in and it becomes a big problem. I can even double their right side. It's a gamble, but I could. We'll see about it. The thing is, I might be slower than their P2. Let's see here. Hail. This changes the play. P2 got hit first. That means it's faster than my Feeny. Um, just a slight problem. A slight problem. But we go Zacian here, either way. You want to go, 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 go? Alright, so they probably saved their Zacian. I'd have to imagine. And they go for the Feeny. I got low battery, I know. They have double Intimidate. There's a, a very fat chance we're getting Intimidated here. Which sucks. With blade. I honestly want to put my water attack here, because I think it's going to be an Intimidate user. I just think I'm going to get destroyed by a max strike, which sucks. 
But I think it's what we have to do. We might lose either way, I think, but we'll see. Protect? Okay, that's better. That was the best case scenario. Okay. I think that's best case scenario. Oh, look at that juicy damage right there. Okay, now they max strike. This should kill Feeny. Okay, we're still faster than their Zation. And now we protect Earthquake, and we should be pretty good there to do a lot of damage. The thing is, they, if they do switch, then they're in a pretty good spot. We'll see. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Let us see. Intimidate. Earthquake should kill that thing, right? I feel like Earthquake will kill that thing. If it doesn't, I'll be very sad because it has Ice Beam. I think it'll kill, right? So I'm gonna protect. And Earthquake. I'm gonna try it. Okay, they swap that. That's expected. Now, if this is an Intimidate user, which it probably is not and that was amazing for us okay I need this to die I need the duck to die thank you okay so now the, the sash is gone on our friend the Shifu hmm <laughs> Okay, now they have Zation. Still a slight dilemma here. I think I always, always, always put my Zation attack into their Zation. Always. Because that'll kill. Now I just don't know what I do with my, my guy here. I want an earthquake, but I don't want to hit myself. I guess I rock slide? I don't know. Okay, the behemoth blade. I really hope I don't die here, because if I didn't click earthquake here and I died and I choked. Oh, they went for that. Okay. Then I think I win. Yeah, I think I won, because what is. What is. Unless two CCs kill me. Ah, two CCs kills me. I can't believe I actually lost that. Max strike. Made the speed stupid. Yeah, that sucks. Can't believe it's just a neutralization attack kills me. I should I, I guess I should have clicked protect there. I didn't I didn't think that I would have lost, but I forgot. Yeah, I should have just clicked protect. Because I clicked rock slide, that was a literally a pointless click. I was basically clicking nothing, I should have just clicked protect. Oh well. Yeah, it's my bad. That's called being better and losing because you forget. But that's like 60% of my losses. That's like a lot of people's losses is just like not clicking the right buttons. But that's what makes Pokemon exciting, right? Like, it's on you to win games. And sometimes you let yourself down. And more often than not, you let yourself down more than your opponent actually beats you. Yeah, I just click protect there and take my free win. Say thank you for trying. But yeah, uh, I just clicked rock slide for no reason. But it's okay. We know we were better that game. We fine. We lose the points, but we don't care about the points. Anyway, yeah, Feeny was good. I lost both games I brought it, but yeah, I think it was fun. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. We'll be back, and we're out of here.